I'm scared. It doesn't seem like folks here are scared enough. In Hong Kong, Singapore, Taiwan, heavily affected by SARS, also Japan, wearing a mask has been a cultural thing for, for quite some years now. The SARS was really a, had a big impact on, on people's mentality in Hong Kong and also other affected places in Asia. I started wearing masks in Taiwan because it was absolutely normal there. In fact, it was a matter of politeness. It was part of the culture. I wish it was part of this one. The Asian nations that had lived through SARS, they understand. Oh, they all stare. Everybody stares. What I've gotten from friends here is that they think I'm sick. So that's the initial reaction. Nobody is wearing face masks here. And the other side of that is that there are none to be had. Germany is just trying to get face masks for their healthcare population at this point. Basically, all my Asian friends wear masks. Zero white friends, like Americans or Latino. No one cares, and and I I said like I told them like this is a serious thing. Even if they have masks, they don't wear it. Wearing masks is something that deep in their mind. Uh, if you get sick, you should wear masks for protecting yourself as well as the people. But in Western countries, of course, it's not the case. Uh, people would think that you are spreading uh, the panic to the public. Uh, part of the reason could be terrorism in Western countries. If you cover your face, people will think uh, you're doing something bad, stuff like that. It hasn't yet uh, changed to be like that in Europe and the United States. Maybe in the future there'll be a change, um, but they haven't had the experiences with SARS that, that people in Asia have had.